So guys, the Epic Gamer here from DJ Shell Gamer Gangs, and today we are doing something different. Today we are playing Bloons Monkey C, which is basically like BTD Battles and BTD5 merged together, and just maybe slight differentiation in format. So I'm just going to teach you how to do the basics of this. So basically, you get you at the start, you just get a couple stuff. To start with, and yeah, you can just grow your empire. So the way you capture land is you just click on that, and then you just go on attack to so get more land. And what you can do with more land is you can build tons more of huts and stuff. Now, with this, you all you can build that, but they've got like special rate. You got the you got like the cost, energy usage, and you've got how much XP it gives you. So I'll just run you through it. So that's how much you've got. Not, oh, not that. That's the top left thing. The gold is how much money you've got, and then underneath it is like the current, or the rare rarity. Well, not that. It's the rare currency. Like for example, in Minecraft, you get diamonds. In Clash of Clans, I think I don't think there is. Any, I think in Clash of Clans, there's gems, and in Bloons Monkey City, you have gemstones. Oh no, blo Bloons stones. So underneath that is energy, and underneath that is your plutonium factory, and all, and hopefully BTD King will explain that to you. So also, you get banana farm, just increase that, to increase your amount of gold, and you just, you can also, what you can do is you can get like special buildings to upgrade your monkeys, so this one here is a dark monkey one. And I'll go into Dark Monkeys. And yeah. So you can get many of them. But you don't have much capacity because one bank is basically the equivalent of 1,500 plus your banana farm capacity. So that's not that much to start off with. So you want to just do that as quick as possible. So I'll just do one just to show you like how to balance stuff. So. So I'm probably going to start a series on this with BTD King and we're probably going to do it with Bloons Master as well. So let's start. So you can also either do the drag and drop, which is what I usually do, and you can, or you can also do drop or lock, which is this. So you just grab it and then when you're comfortable where you place it, you just click there. So I'm just going to move that back quickly. So as you can tell, my ninja is decreased the money it was 500 in battles now it's 415 partly because this is the this is the ninja's favorite map and because it's his favorite map it gets a 15 is it gets a decrease i think it's 15 percent decrease and my banana farm is restricted because of this map because it hates it so much so let's start so we're gonna get a ninja and look see it it goes up to acquired research so basically I need to go to the special building for the ninja and do some more research on that. So it just does. So you can also fast forward as well, which I think is a really good idea because people just don't like just doing it like this. That is really too slow. So you can make it go faster if you think you're really confident with it, which I am at the moment. Because it's only just pigs bothering a double trick ninja. And it's not gonna be that hard. So also, when you've got favoured things, uh, also the upgrades are also decreased as well. Oh, there's a little pond area there, I didn't notice that earlier. So you've also got a decrease on upgrades too, which I think is good too, because some of the upgrades like, uh, if you have a super monkey favoured, I don't know if there is one, but if you have a super monkey favoured, then that temple of the monkey god will go ridiculously down, it'll be like from... 100,000 to like 80 grand or so, which I think is really good because Temple of the Monkey God is so hard to get. It costs a grand. Well, no, not a grand. Everyone would get that then. 100 grand. So, yeah. So, at the moment, I'm just kind of wrecking these balloons. So, also, with the, so basically, for each layer taken off a balloon, you get one mu you get one more bit of money on. So look, see, I'm getting money because I'm popping tons of balloons. You also get a hundred. You also get a hundred more money 
at the start of each round. So look, see, it's gonna go up in a minute. Look, well, once this round is finished, so. So it did start at 1961, now it's went to 2061. Because they get 100 each round. And I might as well put engineering. Oh. Okay, so I've almost done it. This is quite easy. For me to be honest. And there is also like different types of difficulties as well. So there's just one green dot means just trivial which you can skip so if you press attack it'll say uh this is ridiculously easy or something like that do you want to skip you won't get any xp i always do that because i just get money then there is also easy which i'm doing right now because i can't find any tribal lands to show you the thing and also there is medium as well which is three yellow dots and easy is two green dots so medium means uh, with some, maybe with a bit more skill or I don't know, I don't know what it means, like with maybe a bit more skill or with some luck you'll do this. Hard isn't the name really. Very hard is five red dots, hard is four red dots. Very hard is like, this is quite, this, I don't think you might be able to do this with maybe quite a lot of luck you'll do this. And impossible, basically, a play on impossible. So basically, it's a play on impossible. It's very funny, not. So it basically means do not go here is quite hard. And by quite, I mean very. So there is basically the special balloons. Well, no, there's all the balloons from BTD Battles plus some special couple special ones like this one is definitely a special one well you can get it in arena but get it in classic arena battles on bdd but there is one more it's called the ddt now ddt stands for dark dirigible titan and it's basically a moab camouflaged basically so only camo more camo monkeys can hit it and when it pops it just turns into Camo balloons. So yeah, you also get special missions in this. So there's the know, engineer, heli, balloon chipper, and the submarine mission, which you can gain the monkeys from. There is a whirlpool mission, which is I'm not up to it yet. Uh, a special I don't know what that one was. There is a glue gunner mission, a mob graveyard, which comes in with tons of mobs. BPs and ZMGs, you get 30,000 to start off with, and you also get the, ooh, this one here, the temple, which I, I've, I've never done before, but apparently it comes with ZMGs, so yeah, so thanks for watching, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more action, so Hopefully next time BTD King will run you through the more advanced stuff. So, bye.